A few years ago, we led the way in development of 427 LT1, which achieved 700 horsepower naturally aspirated. But we weren't done. We wanted to go back and see how much further we can push the LT1 427 to get more than 700 horsepower. So we developed an all new LT cylinder head that we're calling the LTK. So we take off the factory heads and use a US cast cylinder head that's fully machined here at KTEC. This exhaust port is significantly better than the stock one. It flows quite a bit. Uh, it's got a good thick deck. It'll be good for turbo applications and it'll really clamp down and hold the head gasket well. We also went to larger valves and again, exhaust significantly better, but so is the intake. We're using a big 2200 intake valve and that's a custom titanium intake. And we have a custom steel exhaust Inconel valve and again, very good for a turbo application. After the heads are modified, we needed a camshaft and lifter system to go along with it. Um, so we a little bit more duration, with a lot more lift. These heads are capable of 700 lift on a factory rocker, uh, even more with a gesso or roller tip rocker. This engine also utilizes a custom piston. It works better with the cylinder heads, a big 2200 valve, and get the valve reliefs in the proper location and proper place. The oil pump in this engine is also the K-Tech um, high flow, high pressure oil pump for the LT engines with the high RPM and getting the oil and scavenging, get it out of the windage, uh, it was an important addition to the engine. These new products allowed us to reclaim the Gen 5 LT naturally aspirated record at 806 horsepower. When we ran on dyno, we ran E85 fuel with the MSD intake, which is the standard C7 intake that we run. Uh, it made over 760 horsepower. Uh, we swapped the intakes out and put this Holly High Ram on. Um, that got us to 806 horsepower. Uh, this would be great for drag application, Camaro, um, truck, or any engine that could fit another hood, even a C7 if you wanted to modify the hood. Um, while dynoing, we run full accessories as far as the water pump. So there's a little bit to be had there if someone wanted to run an electric water pump or dyno without an electric water pump. Uh, we run the full intake tube that runs in a C7, so no bell mouth or anything, the standard filter, standard map sensor. Um, so 806 horsepower is very realistic to what you'd receive in the car. So if you're interested in the LTK heads for your engine or want a crate engine with over 800 horsepower naturally aspirated, check out ktechengines.com. <laughs>